Hey, Robert here. I'm gonna break down Porcupine Tree's trains. Um, I have an older video on here that is just a play along. I am working on being able to cover this on my own. I just had a huge breakthrough with being able to do the lyrics while I'm playing. And I'm just getting a ton of requests for, you know, how, how this tune is put together. And you follow me on Instagram, uh, I do have a tutorial on IGTV, but figured uh, for my YouTube fan base, we'll uh, do one here as well. So, okay. First, and the intro. Okay, so here's what it is. I do, it's basically a G chord, right? But I'm just using my ring and middle fingers. Okay. And keep this first finger handy. We're gonna use it for the F chord in a second. But you're just gonna keep that ring finger anchored kind of hammering on the middle finger. So it starts with on an upbeat. <clears throat> okay. So you can just practice that for a while. <clears throat> so I'm just doing up, up, down, up, down. Right, so instead of And then goes to an F chord, just easy F chord. Okay, and I hammer on, so it's we're gonna use those open string sounds as passing chords um, to help us get there. Okay, first part. Da, 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 da. Then it does the exact same thing, but instead of going to F, it goes to A minor. F. E. F. A minor. Right? So it's just back and forth. Here's a different line. The hiss of the train that the railway had it goes. Hiss of the train at the railway head. So F, D, and if you've watched any of my videos, you know when I do a D, I'm typically doing this kind of half bar. So it goes, it's really easy from the F. Here's a neat one. If you're doing that, you're going to a D minor, so you can either roll forward and then put that first finger down on the F note, so it's 2, 2, F. Then it goes to A, okay, F, D, D minor, A minor. This is where the drums come in. 
always have the same breath. Sixty ton angel falls to the earth. Pile of old metal, radiant blood. Here's the F to D. Skulls in the country, summer and her. Now, we skipped the um, always the summers are slipping away. This is basically the chorus. So, D. So, kind of the same idea as before, but backwards. D, D minor, F, A, then G. D, D minor, so D minor, A minor, okay, so it's always the summers are slipping away, okay, uh, the first time it comes it's just a single line, the second time it's Summers are slipping away. D minor. Same thing. Find me a way for making it stay. Okay. And then um, after that, it goes into the guitar solo, which is just it's just over that riff again. Okay. Then, uh, when I hear the engine pass, when I hear the engine pass, I'm kissing you wide, the hissing subsides, I'm in love. When the even nature's here, you're tying me up, I'm dying of love, it's okay. And then, la da 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 that part with just the um, vocalization, it's over this again. Okay, so basically it's two parts, right, with that weird line at the end of each verse where it goes up from the F, right? Okay, so that is 80% of the song. That's all the words, okay? It is all of the verse chorus part, but in the original, and I'll, I'll have a card or something so you can go listen to the um, official music from In Absentia. Um, there's this weird kind of banjo part that's uh, just kind of the banjo rolls and I'll admit, I, I don't have it all figured out perfectly, but it's basically B flat. Sorry. Okay. And I'm just that third fret on the low G. Then it's an F. And then there's a uh, G chord, but leave the A open.
everything else in there, the the G. So if you want to do it live and you don't have that part all worked out yet, it's a one two three 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 four five six one two three four right like a six eight time. You can just strum it. And then it just comes back after that whole section. It repeats the when I hear the engine pass. When I hear the engine pass, um, the hissing subsides in love. Okay. So, real quick, here's the too long that it didn't read. Kind of for this. And if you made it this far, thank you so much. I know a lot of people love this tune. And uh, it's one of those things that I've been spending time kind of playing almost as long as I've been playing this Kamoa. So, pick up. the whole thing. Goes all the way through the verses, right? Last line of each is F, D, D minor, A. The chorus, Hope that's helpful if you enjoyed this if it was helpful please comment down below like the video share it with your friends subscribe to the channel like i said i'm doing a bunch of uh porcupine tree i'm gonna kind of branch into primus soon i think i have some tunes i really want to do um let me know what else you want to hear all that good stuff if you have any questions about this feel free to hit me up on instagram at Robert Rowe Music. Uh, feel free to DM me or send me an audio clip of where you're at so far. Um, I enjoy those kind of conversations uh, over there, and it's easy for me to communicate that way. Uh, sometimes I miss some of the comments, and I apologize for that on YouTube. So there you go. Trains by Porcupine Tree, Mr. Stephen Wilson, and crew. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you try this out. All right? We'll talk to you again soon. Take care.